uh, on the podium at the road map. Cheers, yes. What was that race like for you? Oh, it went, went great really, it was a bit of a disaster. At the start I had uh, mechanical issues and uh, we spent like two laps in the cars. So I was sorting one thing and then like I sort another and I sort another. So it was a bit of a nightmare, I got back and then the, the move had pretty much gone. We tried to get across with Vernon and Oscar on the and Ollie Wood but we just didn't quite have the horsepower. So then it was sort of a case of trying to jump across and we, just, we never managed it and then I guess I made the best of a bad situation at the finish, getting third and I was kind of lucky that it was such a long race really because some of the under 23s lost their legs a bit and I managed to come back but you know the result in the end was, was okay but uh, yeah it wasn't a brilliant race for me. I have no idea what it was like from the start because the break went with Cav and everything. I mean Damien I think went up with it as well. Yeah. It looked like it might have been full gas from the word go. Yeah it, well it was, it was full gas but it was not a like super demanding car so it was alright really at the start you could just pick and choose what you go, what you were going with um, and that one lad went and then we had four of us at the front and Damien was one of them so we were kind of blocking the road and I was just like oh go Damien this is sort of like your because for him it's ideal to be up the road so I, I said oh just go and we blocked the road and Damien got away and then Cav got with him so it was, it was ideal for Damien but no it wasn't particularly hard at the start but just trying to pick and choose what you were in and then then I had mechanicals and that was yeah it was a it was a disaster hour and a half and then managed to get back up back up there from the finish. So when you had mechanical just talk us through that how do you deal with that on the road? Oh, I just try not to stress really and uh, so I had two different mechanicals then I had to change bike yeah. so I was just trying not to stress and just make sure I kept my head and tried to not waste too much energy but you know you've, you've got it I was the whole time it was going through my head that the move was probably going to go like in that first two hours so I was trying to get back to the front as quick as possible but trying not to waste energy at the same time so it was difficult but uh, and what's, what uh, finally, what's the difference between racing with the guys like Cav and the other world tour pros in a British race rather than racing them abroad like you do? Oh, it's, it's the nationals the nationals is just so different to any race really because you know it's just like Almost everyone is a solo rider, like we had a few riders and we're working together but almost everyone's a solo rider really so it's just like band just attacks constantly going. It's totally different because there's no organisation really, no no big teams sat on the front, you're not waiting for a move to establish and be brought back, it's just, it's just chaos from the word go but yeah them, them world tour guys have just got that, that bit of quality, especially especially Cav like it's just on it all day apparently for people who watched it so fair play to Back to Chris tonight. Good. Yeah, 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 we're, we're good at these, so hopefully we can get well, another. We're, we're less. You were up there in the first, first one, too. Yeah, yeah, I managed to win the second round of the Tarsus. Yeah, I think it was second round. Um, but we're less bossed up tonight, so that'll be a miss because, well, he's the national champion. I'd say he's probably the best crit rider in the country at the minute, so we'll miss him, but I reckon we can uh, still do the business. We've still got some quality in there. Yeah, we have got some good men, so we'll see.